This week on today's homeowner, we're kicking off a two-part project where we'll build a great master bedroom addition for a typical ranch style home. If you need more square footage, we'll give you what you need to know while we're putting together the sticks and bricks of today's edition. Now while we're laying bricks outside, Tim is laying plywood inside to get ready for the surprise we hinted at earlier. We're installing a radiant heating system in this floor. Well, everyone's been run out of the inside of the addition because the guy who's taking over is Wes Cisco with Upanor. Wes, you're well underway with our radiant floor system. How did you get so much done so fast working by yourself? Well, it's a system called Quick Track, and what we have here is a half inch plywood. Mm -hmm. On the back you have a heat emission plate and a dovetail groove. This right here allows for our tubing, which is 516 PEX tubing, to go in okay and conduct to the heat emission plate allow an e even distribution of heat across the floor and it's pretty cool the way you have all of these pieces that you're showing us there then i see you have little circle tracks in here so it just basically is a loop that continues and then how does it get all of the heat in there right well what we start off with is that we do a heat loss and that's going to tell us how many loops are requires in other words how many circuits in this mm -hmm. case we have four okay and they run back to a uh, manifold which is our distribution center going to our heat source oh, so at that point we have a circulator and it circulates the warm water through the floor and at that <laughs> point sounds sounds pretty simple now uh, we're planning on putting a, a 3 8 inch pre-finished hardwood on there how do you keep it from expanding and contracting and kind of separating the wood that's perfect um, the application that you're going to have there you won't have any problems with expansion or contraction because that's going to be more of a moisture issue we're mm -hmm. doing is just warming the wood mm -hmm. okay and there's many other applications that you can do now do i understand you can also put it on a wall oh, of course you're going to do a quick truck about four feet up a little wainscoting now you have a nice warm cozy cocoon that you're in hmm. mm -hmm. well now on um, pretty good sized room here for a bedroom it's over 500 square feet any limitations on when you can use this as far as the size of a room no not at all um, basically what you're going to have to do is a heat loss if the numbers work the possibilities are endless man I can't wait to see this thing in place with a few more screws Wes finishes attaching the quick track to the plywood base before he adds some silicone adhesive to each of the grooves and snaps in the tube all of these tubes come together in a manifold, which is then connected to an ordinary water heater. The system is a closed loop, so you don't end up with any stale drinking water, but otherwise you can use whatever hot water source makes the most economic sense. Boy, I'm glad we have plenty of work on the inside because it looks like we're about to get a little rain. You know, one thing I love about the remodeling business, you always learn something new, and that's a lot of new information for me about the Radiant Floor System. You know, I've built probably around 500 additions over the years, and believe me, this one is going great. We got it started with a concrete slab that formed the foundation for our addition. In spite of the weather, our framers got the structure up off the ground in just a few days. We filled all the holes with some great looking windows and doors, and not long after that, the bump up ceiling was ready for the drywall. A little drywall mud and the trim carpenter started tweaking the interior while the brick masons wrapped up the exterior. Hey, we even got a heated floor in this thing. What else would you want? Next week, it all comes together. Our vinyl work, some beautiful landscaping, all the bells and whistles on the inside, and some very nice furnishings. Now, if you want to know more about today's edition, check out our website at dannylipford.com. We'll see you next week. We also want to thank our very special partners on this project. Jeldwin Windows and Doors, Merillat Cabinets, Upanor Radiant Heating Systems, Corda Clean Composite Deck Cleaner and New Tone Lifestyle Home. Next week, we're putting the finishing touches on our today's edition. I hope you'll join us. If you'd like to purchase a DVD copy of this week's show, visit our website at dannylipford.com or call us at 1-800-946-4420.